how to set up a wiki. In this video, you'll learn how to set up your own wiki on Wikispaces. Throughout the video, be sure to pay attention to the parts of the screen circled in orange. First, go to the Wikispaces site. In your URL bar, type in the address www.wikispaces.com. When you get to this screen, click on the Students tab in the Teachers and Students box. You will do this because you're setting up a wiki for educational purposes. You will then come to this welcome screen. Click the green button that says sign up now. Now you'll get a pop-up screen that says join. In the username bar you'll need to choose a unique username that you can remember. You can try your first name and town, all one word, or some other combination that you can easily remember. Type in a password that you'll remember. You may need to write it down. Where it says Make a Wiki, click Yes. Then click the Join button. Now you'll get another pop up screen where you'll need to choose your wiki name. You can name your wiki using your own name. Try not to use your last name. You may use a combination of your name and the word Tech Class, such as Jane Tech Class. It has to be all one word. For example, I created a wiki titled Survey of Tech. Be sure to click the button that says You Certify the Wiki will be used for K-12 education. Then click Create. Now you'll come to the Welcome pop-up screen. This is where you'll get a tour of the basics of Wikispaces. Click the Next buttons and take the short tour. Once you're done, you'll come to a screen that looks like this to welcome you to your new wiki. Yours will have the name you've given it at the top. Mine has the Survey of Tech name that I gave it in the Make a New Wiki screen. Notice that this screen has an Edit button. Anytime you want to make changes to your wiki page, this is the button you have to click. So click it now. Now your screen looks basically the same, except you have this editing toolbar on top. This means you're ready to edit your wiki page. The first thing I do is delete all of the welcome to your new wiki texts that they have there so that I have a clean page. Now I've typed in some new text. I've highlighted the text and now I'm going to click the text editing button to make it look different. Now I've got this text styles pop-up screen. I've clicked the font menu and chosen a new font. I've increased the size of the text to 150%. I've changed my text alignment to center, and I've clicked the text color button to choose a new text color. Once I've made all these changes, I'm going to click Apply. Now my text looks different. Next, I'm going to add a picture. To do that, I click the File button in my Edit menu. I get another pop-up screen called Images and Files. Then I can, I can upload PDF files, Word documents, and pictures. I want to upload a picture, so I click the Upload Files button. When I do that, I'll get access to the files on my computer. I choose a fish picture I had on my desktop. After I choose it, my window looks like this. There's my fish picture. Now I'm going to click on it so it goes into my wiki. Once I click on my picture, it goes back to my wiki page. I can see the picture, but I also see this little menu bar. I'd like my picture to be centered, so I'll click the Center Align button. If I wanted, I could also use this menu bar to add a caption or to resize my picture. Now that I've centered my picture, my page looks like this. I'd like to add a link to my page, so I type some text under the picture that says, Be sure to check out this great website on Tropical Fish. I do happen to have a pretty good website that gives good information about this. In another window, I'm going to open that website and highlight and copy the URL address. Now, back at my wiki page, I want to highlight the text that will link to that page, so I highlight the words, Great Website on Tropical Fish, then click my Link button in my menu. I'll get this link pop-up screen. Right now, it has page or file highlighted on the left. I want to link to a web page, so I'm going to click on that. Now I'm going to paste that URL that I copied earlier on the Tropical Fish site into the address window. Once I've done that, I'll click Add Link. 
Now my wiki page has some nice looking text, a centered picture, and a useful link. I'm ready to save my page by clicking the Save button. Now my page looks like this. Notice that the editing bar is gone and you see the Edit button again. If you want to get back into the page to work on it, click the Edit button. Edit to get in, save to get out. Now I'm going to focus on the little gray menu box to the right. I'm going to click the Members button. That way I can invite others to work on my wiki page with me. Now I get to this Members page. I want to invite people to work on my wiki with me, so I'm going to click Invite Members. Now I get a pop-up screen called Invite People. In the Send To box, I can type in the email addresses of people I want to invite to work on my wiki with me. If you're inviting more than one person, separate the addresses with a comma. When I'm done, I click Send. Wikispaces will send those people an email with a link to the page and the opportunity to set up a Wikispaces account if they haven't already. Once that's done, they have the ability to edit my wiki too. This will be very useful if I'm working on a project with one or more people. We can build and edit a web page together. And that's it. You've created a Wikispaces account and set up a wiki. Remember, now that you have your own wiki, you now have your own URL address for that wiki. Don't forget it, or it may be harder for you to find your wiki when you want to work on it. You may want to bookmark your wiki so you can get back to it easily whenever you want to.